Hey folks, Peter Scott here for Carmichael and Claire Oaks Homes uh, Today's May 4th, and we're going to run through the listings, some new listings for the last couple of days here, all the way going back to uh, Friday the uh, 30th, April 30th, because I was out of town for a bit. So there's 11 new listings. We're going to get right into it. First up here is 6105 Coyle Avenue in Carmichael. Uh, this is a bank-owned property. It's listed at only $129,900. It's uh, 1,045 square feet, three bedroom, one bath. Um, you know, it's in pretty decent shape. It's in, you know, it is, Coyle Creek is a bit of a busier street there over uh, north of Madison behind Home Depot, if you know where that is. And uh, next up we got here, <clears throat> 3111 Terry Way and Carmichael also. I believe it's kind of the same area. This one's listed for 185900 and it's a three-bedroom, two-bath um, with almost 1,200 square feet. And next up we have here 2301 Fallwater Lane in Carmichael. And this is over off of El Camino. This one's listed for... $259,000 and it's a three and three with 1,572 square feet. So good looking house there. And next up we have 3108 Wilkins Way. This is also in Carmichael here over by the river as you can see by Ansel Hoffman Park. Uh, no pictures of this one yet. This is listed at 319. Uh, it's a three bedroom, two bath, about 1,700 square feet. But a great area over here off of, Carma, uh, off of California. A lot of Carmichael ones today. Next up is 2600 Foothill Drive in Carmichael. This is listed at 335. It's a four bedroom, uh, three bath, uh, 2700 square feet. Really nice looking house there, as you can see. Um, it's a custom home and it's about 90% complete. It does need some more work uh, done with it, and it is bank owned. Next up, we have 3341 Arayo Way, and this is actually just a hop and a skip down from my office. Um, these are brand new homes, and they were built, I think, back in like 06 or something. And uh, they were sitting there and sitting there and sitting there until they got foreclosed on. So I haven't been inside, but they look pretty nice from the outside. Although one thing you got to know is here's Araya, and here's some dumpy apartment buildings right here. So it's not the best location, in my opinion. Let's listen at 349, and... Um, you know, it should be a good looking house. My office is right there. Now we have another one with no pictures. This is 7983 Shrewsbury Avenue. And uh, this one is 249. It's a three bedroom and two bath, 1,618 square feet. And it's uh, this one's in Fair Oaks here. Um, and a nice area also. It's got a new roof. Here we have 12417 Paradise Creek Lane in Fair Oaks. It is a townhome, as you can see there. Uh, looking pretty nice on the inside. Um, so they're newer. I think they're just a couple of years old here. Uh, pretty decent location. Uh, but you are going to have an HOA there. Not sure exactly what it is right now. And next up, we have 4805 San Juan Avenue in Fair Oaks. Uh, if you don't know, San Juan is a bit is a busier street. Well, it is a busy street here, but this is a pretty big house. It's listed for $299. Um, but a uh, pretty good looking house. And it's 2,438 square feet, a four bedroom, three bath. And it's uh, completely renovated. Uh, it's got new kitchen, new HVAC. Um, so it's in real prime shape there, but location probably not so hot. Sorry, I'm buzzing through these, but I got a time limit here. So we're at 4924 Forest Dahl Street in Fair Oaks. This one's listed for 395, and it's a five bedroom, three bath, 2,300 square feet, uh, and a pretty nice neighborhood over there. Okay, last up is 424 Vista Del Lago Way in Fair Oaks, a well-positioned home at 686 500. Four bedroom, three bath, 3,700 square feet, and just look at that. Isn't that stunning? Uh, over near the river, just a beautiful looking home. Well, I'm out of time, folks. We'll get you next time. Fill out the, uh, the form on your right there, and we can get you more listings. Adios.